crash in Spring Grove overnight. Yeah, police say that the driver was killed and three others were rushed to the hospital, including a baby. Natalie Clark live with what we know right now about this crash. Natalie, good morning. Very preliminary right now. Very preliminary, Colin, but we do know that the driver of that sedan was killed in this accident after the car crashed into this home. You can see here behind me, and I'm told that they were coming down this uh, hill here in, to take a pretty sharp curve, but uh, the driver failed to negotiate that curve and ended up hitting the left side of this house on the basement window. And you can imagine the sound that that would have made inside this home. I'm told there were people inside. They are okay, but you can imagine uh, what that was like. But I am told that two other people were taken to the hospital with serious injuries. They were adults. Also a, a baby inside the car. Police guess uh, that that uh, baby was under a year old. Thankfully in a car seat. The baby was uh, since released from Children's Hospital. The two individuals are in the hospital right now. We're told with serious injuries and what led up to the crash is uh, still unknown. But there are some factors that investigators are considering. I want you to take a listen to this sound. Looking at uh the road conditions and, and, the, and the yard, it does look like the vehicle just left the roadway and into, uh, into a ditch uh, before striking the house. Well, again, uh, one person killed. The house just has a broken basement window. There is no structural damage, I am told. And according to that officer out here on the scene, he did speak to me a few moments ago, and he said that the baby was in a car seat, and they believe that car seats save lives, and that could have been very much uh, the, the instant happening here in this situation. So thankfully, that baby is okay and released from Children's Hospital. Reporting live, Natalie Clark, WLWT News 5.